right, Tom and Dawn here. Listen, we're in front of Port Authority over here near 42nd Street and 8th Avenue. I mean, this is one heck of a bu busy district here in downtown. But it's really cool because we're on our way down to someplace special, aren't we? Oh, yeah. David Letterman. We're going to be on David Letterman. Now, you know, not quite on as guests, but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be sitting in the audience. So keep an eye open. We're going to give you a wave out. Right, Dawn? Woo! Should you be a fun. It. We intend to be in the front row, so it's going to happen, Front row, man. baby. David we'll Letterman. Take you. We'll take you in as far as we can go. Alright, so we made it here, man. Woo, we're the first in line. First in line. This is an earlier taping, believe it or not. So it's going to be kind of cool. cool. We're going to hang in line for a little bit. Maybe get a Soprat hot dog. You know, I mean, those, those hot dogs. You know, I, I'm starting to think that this entire trip is all about cookies and pizza and hot dogs. And, Might well, be. Well, it's New York, isn't it? Alright, so we're going to be in this, uh, in this line here for the next few minutes for the late show with David Letterman. It's going to be a blast, though. I don't know if we'll be able to take you actually live into the audience, but if we can do it, man, you're there. If not, we'll fill you on, how, we'll fill you in on who's the guest, when to watch, and how it went. All right, all right, man, hot hang dog. with us. Hot, no, hot dog. Where hot is dog, it? Hot dog. Some bread hot dogs, right there, right baby. There. The best. All right, so we're on the line here. This is the first line, but the second step in the process to getting to see David Letterman or being part of the audience. Of course, the first step was answering a trivia question. And at the end of this blog post, this video, I'm going to give you an opportunity to answer the same question that Dawn and I did to be able to participate as an audience member and see if you have what it takes to be a member of the David Letterman audience. But either way, we're online. We're waiting to get our tickets. And I think the next step is to be sent out again. We're going to go have a beer or so in a bar and maybe then come back in line to finally get into the show. Now here's the kind of interesting thing. They tape two shows in one day and they're, they're in the process of taping one right now as we wait. There was another line before us. And it's kind of cool because Lady Gaga I think was on that first show. Would have been fun to see. Her work in terms of the precision dancing and stuff would have been really neat. But I think we're going to get an opportunity to see Ray Romano, which is also kind of fun. So stay with us. We're in the second step in the process of being in the audience at David Letterman. Okay, so we're at Three Monkeys, and this is kind of like uh, the audience green room, basically. Yeah, this is the equivalent of the audience green room. This is where they send you after being on the first line to get your tickets, and then they send you over to place where I guess they, they're hoping you might get a little bit intoxicated so you get more outrageous as an audience member. That could yeah. be, and the bar is just right around the corner, and so we're what? We're waiting until we're that's right, that's right. We have now we haven't had any drinks, you know, we just have a little spread hot dog, so we're thinking, eh, you know, we'll hold off a little bit. But maybe a little bit later on. Either way, we're looking forward to the next leg in the journey to the David Letterman audience. Oh, and we also had to come up with a question that he's gonna right. ask the audience. Right. He likes to get a little bit more intimate with his audience, and so if we come up with some outrageous question that he likes, he's gonna pick us, us. <laughs> Uh, that's right, absolutely. So we'll see. We'll tell you what our question is if we have to get called upon to ask a question. I have right? three. I have three you good have three? ones. Yeah. I have uh, I have two. I have been told they're all good. We'll let you know what they are. I told you they were good. I know, you're the only one. You're the only one who's been surveyed. So I mean it's really not fair, but maybe you can help us out later on. All right, so we're in the home stretch now. This is the very last line, the third leg of qualifying to get into the audience of David Letterman. This is gonna be real. <laughs> Man, we just let out of David Letterman. It was an absolute blast. I got to tell you something. It's a process to go there. I mean, just getting in is kind of a blast, but there is a bit of a process, like a three stager. We kind of took you through all of those steps, but the very first step was answering a trivia question from one of David's staff. To, that would qualify you as, let's just call you an avid late night watcher, which I'm not necessarily, but I'm familiar with it. I'm a New Yorker, right? So the question was this. Paul Schaefer, 
as you know, he's the leader of the the Tonight Show band, right? Or late night band, I should say. And he's known for wearing something special on show, on the show, on television. What is that special thing he's known for wearing? That was the trivia question I was asked. So down below, you'll see a link. Hit that link. Go to our trivia question survey. Answer that question correctly, and we're going to send you a special audio file that's going to help you perhaps break through some fears, doubts, and uncertainties, and maybe even give you an opportunity to be on David Letterman. So just click that link, answer the survey question, what is Paul Schaefer known for wearing on the show? And it's yours. We love you. Thanks for taking this journey with us. We appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed it. The show was great.